everybody it's Kent with Muskoka Property Care back with another plowing video uh, we promised this in the last one as we ran out of time to show any residential plowing uh, our last video was uh, plowing of our condo building so if you want to check that out go back and watch that video as well if you've already watched it we appreciate your continued support and hope you enjoy this one along the way we're just giving a couple tips and tricks on how we plow out residential driveways uh, whether they be gravel asphalt and what if you enjoy this content please don't forget to like and subscribe we'll be coming out with another video probably uh five or six days from now as we'll be getting another storm in about uh three days so by the time we edit probably saturday or sunday uh, enough talking here in the office uh we'll talk to you guys out in the uh, plow truck hope you enjoy that tree but there's also a rock face in there was just pure laziness because I normally shovel this but it is freezing today I don't really want to get it I do have to shovel the walkway though which is fine section and you want to end up with two feet at the end of the driveway you normally only have about a couple inches when they plow by. And we are going to go to town next. Uh, just because town's a little busy because everyone's getting off work so we'll go to town, do our out of town run and then we'll come back in say seven o'clock it's five o'clock right now 
um, and get the rest of these done. And I lied. What we'll do next is uh, we'll go to a good client of mine. Um, he actually helped my grandma, my uncle out quite a bit. So I basically plow his for free all winter long. Um, just as basically a thank you for basically 10 years of checking on my uncle and my grandma who lived on the same street. dragging it out um, normally push forward but we've got a ton of snow this year so I kind of want to save as much space as I can um, so when we get a bigger snowfall that's harder to back drag then I'll uh, I'll push it back into that corner that you see right over there driveways well we can uh, still film and still light out
load of gear. Now this one's got a lot of trade cover that's coming up, but So it'll be, it'll be about a half inch on some spots, and then it'll be three inches on others. So we'll see what we need to do here. probably be the last one that we get on video solely because it is getting dark ladies and gentlemen it's about uh, 6 30 I guess we'll be out here till uh, probably midnight If you enjoyed that uh, plowing content and a little bit of uh, snow talk, yes. like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below uh, if you guys use kind of a different technique or uh, what you guys do, if you have any comments. And uh, stay tuned for more videos. We don't get a lot of uh, daytime plowing, but when we do, I'll be trying to get videos every time. All right, thanks very much. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time.